the vessel MV Ocean Quest has big spaces rooms for passengers and crews and can carry up to 150 passengers and over 100 tons of cargoes. The vessel will be operating between the East and West Sipik provinces and across the border to Jayapura. Maprik MP John Simon says poor road conditions have always been a big problem for his people who travel frequently across the border. The vessel will now give them another option. The three provincial capitals like Vanimo, Wiwek and uh, Jayapura, there's an understanding there. So we've got our mayors and members been traveling between the three provinces. But we'd like to get the link done between the two provinces and Jayapura. The vessel will be operating under a commercial arrangement with a businessman from Maprik. It will be managed by Maprik Investment Limited, a business arm established by the district. Simon says with the government's initiative to open up free trade between Papua New Guinea and Indonesia, the vessel will be a crucial link. And we have a lot of economic activities going on, especially with vanilla and cocoa activities. And we'd like to break into the market on the other side. As I said already, the economy on the other side is much bigger than Papua New Guinea economy. But we need to uh, open this gap up. We've been talking about it. The member said with Indonesia being a much bigger economy than PNG, the service will allow for more investment opportunities for the two CPIC provinces as well as Indonesia. He also called on the government to support them in opening up free trade between the two countries. Uh, I'd like to ask the other members as well, including the, government, uh, the provincial government in East Sipik and West Sipik to also support. And let's take this as a first initiative and uh, see how we go by supporting it. That could open up the doors. Rayon Lakingu, National MTV News.